today, I'm gonna be spending a little bit of Robux to fly the furthest in the entire game. All right, let's see how this goes. We're speeding up. Come on and jump. Are you kidding me? Is this a joke? We only got to the first level? Ladies and gentlemen, we have some work to do. I see a bunch of coins lying around, so let's see what happens if I collect a bunch of these. We should also probably buy our first upgrade, which is times two coins, which is only 25 Robux. That's not half bad. Later in today's video, we'll be checking out the VIP area, but for right now, I want to see just how I can do in the normal plebeian area. Okay, now that I have 100 coins, let's head over to the shop and let's see what I can buy. We can get a speed multipiler that will multipile the speed you get when you cross the white line. All right, let's do that. There's also a shady witch in the corner. She's selling a stranger brew only of the lie, but during Halloween. I feel like this will either make me run super fast or it might give me poisoning. Bottoms up. Whoa, it turned me into a ghost. Does that mean I could fly? Let's try it out. Boom, whoa, that actually worked. I went 600 studs. I think we can also buy something called the Midnight Trail. It's only seven Robux, so I have a feeling that it's probably not gonna do much, but we might as well go test it out in three, two, one. Here we go, jump, come on. Oh, that's my best one yet. We got 1,200 studs. And it seems like the further we go, the more coins we actually get. So it looks like the people at the top of the rank leaderboards have a speed multiplier of 70. So let's go ahead over to the shop and let's buy another speed multiplier. So now our speed multiplier is at three. How much faster does this actually make me? Let's try it out. And uh, all right. So turns out you actually need to time your jumps in this game because if you don't, you will fall very short of where you're trying to get to. I also see people like zigzagging here. Does that actually help? Can you just zigzag your way to victory? No, no, that did not really do much. If I time my jump right at the end, we can actually go super far. Check this out. We just got past 2,000 and we landed on 2,500 studs. That was so cool. There's got to be a way to speed this up. So if I click this button, we can actually buy, I think it's 450 coins. Is that it? Can I only buy that many at a time? I wish it would let me buy like 100,000 coins and then I could just max out my speed multiplier. All right, right now I could buy it again to get four. It should be five. And then if I go again, we could probably get six. Doobie, 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 doobie. Boom. All right. All right. I really am messing this up big time. Jump. Come on. Why are we going even less far than last time? I gotta be doing something wrong. I think it's really just about how you do it at the end. That one is good. Yo. Check that out. We got past 5,000 and then we skated past to 6,100 studs. And the best part is we get tons of money for this. So the further that I can get, the better upgrades I should be able to buy. All right, that time was only 3,100, which means that I got around $240. But if I check this out, that should be enough for another speed upgrade. And it turns out on the right side of the screen, there is a nuke. And wait a second, this actually gives you plus 950 coins, which means that if I nuke the server, we get more coins than if I just go and buy them normally. That is actually kind of crazy. They are incentivizing me to nuke the entire server. I did it for the coins. You guys gotta believe me. I love humanity. We need to buy just a few nukes in order to get our money up. I think it's about that time. <laughs> <laughs> I do feel bad. I do feel really bad. Basic said, shaking my head. I gotta spend all my Bobux, man. Somebody says, stop. And it's a two time server boost. Okay, we need to get past 20,000 again. No, 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 that was bad. That is not 20,000. That is only 500. Come on, come on, Jack. Don't mess us up. Boom. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. 3,700, that is rookie numbers. What if I look at my butt the entire time? Did it work? How far did I go? 200 studs. What about if I look at my character sideways? Let's see about this one. Yo! Oh! Oh, we are flying right now! That's it! That's the strategy, guys! Oh my gosh! I don't even know how far that I'm going. Did I break the game? Hold on, hold on. We're coming back down to Earth. Let's see. We bounced, too. That's great. What are we at? 55,000! 80,000! It just, like, ended! Wait, what? Did I break it? I think that the coin multiplier ended, and then it just, like, deleted my run. And it didn't give me any coins for that. Oh, come on, dude. 
All right, let's see. Let, let's try that again. That's it. That's the strategy right there. I don't think I got too much speed on that one, but I am going faster and faster, especially as I come back down, hurling to the earth like a meteor from outer space. We got 12,300 studs. All right, so this has to be the strategy. That's it. That's it. Okay, it's easier to get further with that strategy. Oh my gosh. We are so high up right now. Fly, little guy. Fly. Keep on flying all the way. You are now the rocket man. Oh, how far did we go this time? Let's see. We're landing on 19,000 studs. What's next? What's next? Let's see. Oh, okay. So I, I get it now. As soon as you land, that's how far you go. So it's not like you can keep bouncing further. The spot that you land, that's your spot. That's how far you flew. And I tried to do it the normal way. The normal way is not it anymore, guys. So if, you, or if you're trying to get far in this game, make sure you guys use the sideways method because this way seems to do wonders. Yeah, that way is like an instant hurled up rocket ship to outer space and it just sends you as far as you could possibly go. We are coming back down to earth and we landed on 22.6 thousand studs. Not bad. That means we can afford to get another upgrade. Our speed multiplier is now 13. It's going to be really difficult to get to that 70 speed multiplier that so many people have done before, but I was checking out the other leaderboards and it seems like somebody else that I know has decided to top the rankings of the donation leaderboard. So if I click this button in the bottom right hand of the screen, we can actually donate. It looks like I can only donate 500 Robux at a time. That means I need to donate quite a few times if I want to get to number one on this leaderboard. So far, we've donated 1,000 Bo Bucks. These guys in chat are having a conversation about what time their entire family sleeps. And then every three seconds, it pops up on the screen. Big bro cookie man donated 500. <laughs> Everybody on this server is sick of me. So far, we've donated 5,000 Robux. Just 3,500 more to go. King Monkey said, how much Robux you got? Abby just said, bruh. <laughs> Bro is giving his life savings. We're at 8,000 right now. All we got to do is donate 10 more Robux, and we will be at the top of the donation leaderboards. All right, let's see if that worked. Let's go. We did it. We're number one on the donation leaderboards. It'll probably be the only leaderboard that I top today. Somebody said, wow, that was not worth it. Shut up, Abby. Now that I'm a big baller, can I get into the VIP area? Uh, no, I can't. I need to spend another 150 Robux. Okay. All right. Dooby dooby doo. We are now inside the VIP area. Inside the VIP area. I said inside the... Why is it not working? Oh, it says rejoin if purchased. Oh, I guess I got to rejoin. And Abracadabra. Yeah, we made it inside. Whoa. Oh, wait, these are actually worth a lot. Yo, check this out. Okay. All right. And then you got ghosts doing the, the boogie in here. Sweet. Sorry to, sorry to come in here and steal all your coins, guys. I just, I'm just trying to become the best ever. I'm trying to ash catch them this game. All right. That actually was not a lot of coins. The best way to get coins in this game is simply by flinging your body for money. I also just realized too, it's, it's ragdolling me. I didn't even realize that. What, was that happening before? I have no idea. Let's see. Let's try it again. Boom. Okay, we are soaring through the skies right now. I could feel the wind in places that you should never feel wind. Let's see what happens. Oh, wait, wait, no, I did not ragdoll this time. I did not ragdoll. I don't know how to get myself to ragdoll, but I kind of wish that it happened every single time. So I just checked out the rebirth shop and we could actually purchase this using 10 speed multiplier points. So let's do that. The next one costs 20 speed multiplier, but supposedly now, even though it's reset, I should get a better multiplier on all of my coins. Yeah, that time I got 40 coins for just landing on 200 studs. So wait a second. If I go into the VIP area, I think these also give me more coins. Yeah, they do. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, now that we have 3.64 thousand coins, we can go ahead back to the shop and we can just upgrade our speed multiplier a bunch. Let's see what we could do. We can purchase that. I really wish I could spam this. The first 10 levels of the speed multiplier don't really cost too much. We can also buy two times our rebirths. So that next time I rebirth, we'll go from two to four. <laughs> Somebody else launched a nuke. It's no longer just me. I don't even know what happens when you get nuked. Is it bad? I think everybody just dies. So I guess if you're about to have a really good drop and you're about to get a ton of coins, that is the worst possible thing that could happen. But it does give you a lot of coins. So let's go ahead and double up the nukes. Everybody gets so mad in chat whenever a nuke gets launched. Somebody else launched another one. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, that's awesome. I don't even know why I tried to run and jump. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's hilarious. People are like, dude, stop. Come on. I feel like I gotta do this. Somebody else is doing it too. I'm gonna buy one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. That's awesome. Oh, look, two times coin server boost. All right, so I've been doing some math, right? I've been doing some calculations, and it seems like the straighter of a line that you run in, the better that you actually do, the further you go. So I'm gonna try to line this up perfectly. I'm gonna be like right here. I think this is as straight as they get. So we're just gonna try this and uh, no. All right, never mind. Don't listen to me. I have no idea what I'm talking about. This might be the highest that I've been. And the only way that you can actually tell is just by looking at the line of the blocks that you're going to land on. The tinier that gets, that's how high you are, I guess. That's the only way to tell how high you are in comparison to anything else. We're coming back down. What is that? Was that 110,000? studs again. I think it actually was, which is insanely good. And now wait, there's a two times server boost. That might be big. Okay. So if I go over to the shop, let's purchase this. We now have a speed multiplier of 20. Let's see what we could do with this one. That was, that was terrible. That was probably the most, most depressing thing I could have done. We got to do better this time. Come on. Yes. That one felt good. We're going so high up. Okay. If I land this, we'll get two times the coins and I should be able to immediately buy another speed multiplier. Fly away, Jack. Jackathon. Come on, Jackery. What are we at? What are we at? What are we at? Oh, 120,000 studs I just saw. Guys, we have 15,000 coins. We need to buy another speed multiplier. We need to take advantage of this two times server coin boost. This one is the one, guys. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones right now. We're going super far this time. I can't even tell where the blocks are anymore. Like you can kind of just barely make out the line of blocks, but honestly, below my body, I can't tell. We need to hit it before the, the 10 second timer ends. What do we get? 140,000 studs, dude. That is unreal. That is awesome. I'm gonna keep grinding this game. Make sure you guys comment down below if somebody takes my spot on the leaderboards. Leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe so we can hit 2 million subscribers before the end of this year.